what's this Sam? Look. So True's gonna play. Um, I want the the, the one True. Which one? The Which polar one? bear. No, the white the white one. The white one. Yeah. The panda. The panda. <laughs> a polar bear. Come on, True. I feel like it's not gonna grab it. It's quite slippery that one. Come on, love your <gasps> Oh my god. Oh, that was actually. Don't let the street And it's really good because then they show you how many people in front of you. So right now there's 143 groups in front of us. Yeah. So we were just wandering around. We're in the Ginza area, um, but we're gonna go back into Tokyo Plaza. Is that yeah. what it's called? Yeah. yeah. Um, we're gonna go back in there to stay dry. There's some shops in there, so maybe we'll browse. But yeah, it's a rainy day, so all you can really do is go inside and browse. It's really thick rain though. Yeah, yeah like, like the drops are massive. Yeah, massive. <laughs> it's like attacking us. <laughs> Walking past this, it smells so good. Show your face. Mm. We're hungry, we haven't had breakfast. This is our breakfast. Mm. Good? Mm -hmm. Would you rate it? Oh, I think you'll like it, really. Really? Mm -hmm. Why? It's very seafoody. Do you want to take the uni of mine then? I'll just mm -hmm. the beef. Mm. Melts in your mouth. That's so good. What's this? Seafood sauce. It's like butter. It's literally like butter. Oh, waggy sauce. That's what I need. It's so good. I want to try both of you, though. No, I like it. Do you? Yeah. It's so buttery. Mm. Good on the sauce. Good start to this food vlog. Yeah, that was a nice one. £33. No, I think it's the uni as well that made it more. Okay, should we go? Next okay, week we've got, we've got to get on. It's about speed we've got lots of food yeah. to try out. I'm a mind with the way you work it. In my line and I'll make it worth it. 
Just grind in the place you perfect. We got it back another kind of purchase. I'm a mind with the way you work it. In my line, so we're waiting in line. Let's see what you're wearing today, Jerry. So I'm wearing my Loewe colorful jumper, this Helsa maxi skirt, my Sambas, and my Mew Mew bag. I feel like you popped in this market. I do. I really stand out. Yeah. Hi. Hi. Can we have the fish cake with shrimp and scallop? Okay. And the corn. Hi. I want to try the corn one because that's the one that I am most intrigued about. What was it again? Fish cake. Something corn. with fish with corn. Good. Mhm. Mm it's very sweet, very corny, but like the texture comes from the fish. It's very nice. It's not too fishy. My turn. Mmm. It just tastes very corny, which is no. nice. And very sweet. Here, do you want to hold it? Like chewy, corny. Mm -hmm. This is um, shrimp and scallop. You have the first taste of this one. Mmm. 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 Oh my god. Texture of everything is so good. It looks really greasy, but it doesn't feel greasy. Right, you can actually. It's windy now. You can down the whole thing. What was the last one? It's a mixture. So I think that one's a corn one. Let's try this one. Mm. Oh my god, that's so good. That is so good. I think that's the best one so far. Yeah, and then this one. That's like a potato thing, right? Mm -hmm. It's so good. Everything is really good. Mm. I'd give this taste a 10 out of 10. Yeah, 10 out of 10. Very it's good. very delicious. Flavorful. It does. Let me try this big piece. It tastes like a packet of fresh. Really? Mm. I think it's that spice seasoning. The, the seasoning, yeah. Mm. I really want to get some more wagyu because that wagyu we had at the start was so good and we shared a skewer. Mm -hmm. You got one each. But I'm going to get, yeah, but one without uni, I think. We're literally trying to make our way to the wagyu place but everything looks so good. <laughs> I'm not sure how to tackle this one. I think you just have to bite it from the side. Mm. It's gonna make a bigger mess. I think this is the one you should have done. <laughs> I'm gonna let True bite it first I'm to make it pave easier. The way. Pave the way for me. There we go. It's really fresh. It tastes really fresh and mm. yeah. Look if I push it down like that. There we go. So oh, that no. was, what was that? Um, I broke it. Tofu skin. I think it would just break it apart like this. Yeah, and just and eat it like that. that. That's what yeah. I'm going to do. The crab tastes really fresh, and then the tofu is really sweet. So it's a really nice, like, salty and sweet combination. Yeah. It's a nice combo. I'm getting combo. quite full now. Okay, but there's this Wagyu place. So we're going to finish off with Wagyu. And it's very popular, and I need some Wagyu. So let's yeah. go there. Say hi to the vlog. Yeah, hi, vlog. <laughs> I love this. She's from New York yeah. and we met in Tokyo. Yeah. Literally, how crazy is that? I love it. Thank you. Finally got the Wagyu again. Also, the guy said it's actually good to, um, to see when they make the Wagyu because apparently in Tokyo, a lot of places mix the meats. So yeah. this is like pure Wagyu. Mm, I'm very excited. How it's super popular it as well. Is that good? Wow. 
so buttery. Mm. How's it with the sauce? Should I have it with sauce? Mm -hmm. The sauce just slides off because it's so oily. Mm. Not so fatty. Guys, we're going on one of these. One of these. Two, one, go. Oh my gosh. Yay. <laughs> <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you. This gate is the main gate of Sensoshi Temple. The Sensoshi Temple is the most famous temple in Japan. Yeah, because to visit 30 million people each year. They're like not very clever, so you put it into the, towards oh. you. But if you play football and stuff, you put it towards your foot. Ah, so you put yeah. it wherever you want it to be. Yeah, basically. <laughs> What's this temple called? Mat. It's so difficult, okay? <laughs> Matsuchiya Mashoden. Matsuchiya Mashoden. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> Well, it's very corporate for a casual dinner date. No, it's not casual. The only thing <laughs> corporate is this, really. Yeah. Well, and the yes. coat. Yeah, because I was basically I was wearing this shirt because we were trying to shoot a, another picture, so I just changed the skirt. Because I was wearing a skirt with this, so I changed the jeans. But I like it. I feel like it's a smart casual. Dinner. Oh my god, I need all of them. 
I need them all. Seriously, I need the shark one. I have Let's the shark. Let's do the 500. What about the little chicken? Look at the back. Get, try and get that one, okay. Yeah, that one. I think just press it now. I think the trick is though, to find one closest to the thing because... Oh my God. <gasps> no truth. We got it, we got it, we got it. Okay, look. Oh my God. Guys. We did it. Oh my God. Oh my God, oh my God. Oh my God. Oh, yes. yes, we got it. Okay, I'm literally so excited right now. Okay, we. Oh, I'm really happy. You want the chicken and the shrimp. Thank you, True. You're my hero. Survivable now, not doing any task. Baby boy got the bounce, I'm floating by the ounce. Okay, confidence sprout like a garden of bloom. Y'all polluting my style. Okay, nah, y'all be fishy like trout. Fever green like I'm grass. Asking now, maybe soon. Pray my homies as well, pray my homeland as well. And when I'm back to my city, I bring it back on my bill. Thank you very much for your attention. Please take off your shoes and enter. guys we did a little 7-eleven run there's one right by our hotel which we only discovered now um after dinner we decided to go for a sweet treat also how was dinner true we didn't say did you like it you loved it yeah that was the first sober meal we've had here mm -hmm. and it was really delicious i really liked it i had the cold one and it literally met my expectations like it's refreshing satisfying and light at the same time i had i really like it yeah my one i but it was a bit bland. It wasn't bad, but it wasn't my favorite meal. Okay, first of all, I'm gonna have a drink first because I'm really thirsty. And I picked up this. Um, it's a chilling drink. And I thought, I didn't know if it was alcoholic or not. So I checked using True's um, Google image translate. And this is the drink. Look at the packaging, so pretty. It's got a cat on it. But it's one of those relaxing drinks. Chilling. Chilling, yeah, yeah to make you relax. It's literally called a relaxation drink. Yeah. And I've got Milk protein, milk protein from Meiji. Meiji, Meiji. Meiji. We keep seeing that brand. Oh, that is nice. Okay, should we have the ice cream first? Mm -hmm. So yeah, that's gonna melt. This is Yukimi Daifuku. This is the first one. It looks kind of like a mochi ice cream. And then the second one. Chocolate covered ice cream. 
Oh, look at the packaging at the back. It's so cute. I need to show that. Let me unbox this. Oh, yeah. Yukimi Daifuku. They had a blue one as well. I didn't know what the difference was. Oh, they give a stick. This is what I love about Japan. I feel like they think of everything. I feel like we should give some tips mm. or things that we've learned. So my first one, what true tries that, is that, um, so I didn't know the tax-free works like in other countries that we've been to, the tax-free works like when you buy something, you ask for a tax-free receipt, they give you the tax-free receipt. Then when you go to the airport, you have to get that like stamped to the airport and then do the whole process in the airport to get your money back and the money comes back like a couple of weeks later but here it kind of works like as if you're in an airport so you have to have your passport with you and then you just give them the passport and they charge you the tax free price already so your money like you don't get a refund you just get charged the tax free amount which is really good so everywhere you go well most places do tax free so you just have your passport and they just charge you the tax free amount oh, is, really good. is it good 10 out of 10 texture really very creamy it works really well i think daifuku is like rice as well it went on my teeth and it really hurts mmm <laughs> the inside it tastes like um cream rather than ice cream well that's what cream. ice cream is ice <laughs> no but it tastes more like a it's do you know what creamy. i mean it's more creamy yeah more creamy it's very buttery mmm mm -hmm. i think you have scones mm-hmm Clotted cream. Clotted cream. Mm -hmm. And then, true, what did you learn? Life hack number two. You can get your Pasmo or Suica card directly on your Apple wallet. So you don't, you don't even have to apply for anything. You don't have to go into any station. You literally just go on your Apple wallet and click add a travel card. And then from then you can add money onto those cards via your Apple Pay. So it's all like very convenient. Yeah. In one place. And you don't have to fiddle around with cash, which is yeah. really good. And so that's for the train. And also, in restaurants, you can pay using your passport. So today, the restaurant I went to, they don't accept cash or credit cards. No, yeah. they accept cash, sorry. <laughs> they don't accept credit cards, and we run out of cash. So then True just put money, topped up his passport on his phone, and then yeah. paid with his passport. Yeah, so passport can pay for your shopping, travel, so buses, trains, um, restaurants, food. Yeah, we should have got it for Kyoto. Yeah. It just saves you the hassle of having to get the right amount of cash out every time or... Yeah, it's super easy to pass me. So on the first day we got, we went to the metro and got the cards, you would have seen in the vlog. But you actually don't need to do that, just do it on the app. Yeah. Not the app, cool. but yeah. Look guys, they give... I love this, they actually just think of what would someone do when they open this, but they have to use their hands. Let me use this one. Okay. This is what it looks like. Chocolate covered ice cream. That's really nice, isn't it? Mm. Oh my god, the ice cream tastes different here. Yeah, the ice cream it's is so, so creamy. good. Yeah, it's very creamy. It doesn't taste like ice cream. It's a bit like, has that mouth feel. Mouth feel? Yeah. What does that mean? Because it doesn't just dissipate into a liquid. It's like... Oh, it's like... Sli not slimy, but a bit more texture. Creamier. Creamy. Yeah, I think the key word we're mm. looking for is cream. Kit Kat. Strawberry. Oh my god, it smells so strong of strawberry. Oh. As soon as I open that. Oh, they are little bites, but I'm gonna do a little. You can really taste the strawberry. I feel like I need another one because I still have a taste of the. Mm -hmm. I bet our taste buds are covered in sugar now. Do you like that? Mm -hmm. I would buy it again. I would. Really? Yeah, it's like a different. Mouthful. <laughs> Keep saying that word. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the ice cream feels mouthy. <laughs> okay. No, that was then good. this little mushroom. So the, again, the brand Meiji. Meiji. Oh, maybe they do. Same like brand as they do chocolate. chocolate. Yeah, because they keep seeing their shops. So. Oh my God! They're they're um. This is genius. They're the like biscuits. Remember those. Do you know those little treats in London that we have where um, you dip the breadsticks into the chocolate? I think so. Well, this is basically that, but you don't have to dip it. It's already dipped. It's um, chocolate, and then this is like a breadstick. It's like those chocolate sweets. Uh -oh. mm. That's nice. I don't really I like that one. that one. That's not unique enough for me to like get it again. No, this is a snack that I could see myself just having lots of. It's so nice. Have another one. No, but like the flavour is just... Mm. It's just so familiar. 
No, because that's what I said. It reminds me of those. Um, it's like a blue packet, and it has a section. You know, mm -hmm. Nutella do that as well, like little breads they can just put. Mm -hmm. I love that. Mm. I like you. I feel like this is every Asian country's sweet. We first discovered this in Hong Kong. Mm-hmm. Every time, it bangs. guys we are leaving on friday today is wednesday and today's plan is to basically get gifts for everyone i've picked up true and i've both picked up little bits here and there as we've been shopping but we've made a list today of people we need to buy gifts for and what we want to get for them so we want to get some matcha and like the matcha tea sets we want to get a lamp for true sister we want to get something for my sister and then something for my friends so today's a day of shopping we're heading to shibuya now to go and get some brunch um i found this cute cafe that does like omelettes and pancakes so we're gonna head there this is like shaky <laughs> it's like wonky by the way true is being my human tripod right now because <laughs> we're just running out now and i can't hold the camera for too long because my hands shake anyway <laughs> um yeah so we're going to shibuya now we're gonna get a taxi to get some brunch and then we're gonna have a day of shopping and exploring and in between we might go to a little cafe and get some like coffee and snacks so we'll bring you guys along today <laughs>
t-shirt. So guys, we picked up some gifts. Shopping. Oh, did we? Did you show the jacket you got as well? Yeah. True picked up okay. this really cool Dior uh, Sakai jacket, which is made in Japan. And Sakai is a Japanese brand, so I thought that was a really cool purchase. I actually found that one for you, True. Yeah, I've actually done more shopping than Nuri in this trip. Yeah, but we. I think I feel like we kind of expected that. Yeah, because a lot of things like fit me nicely. Um, just, yeah. yeah, and it's the opposite for me. Like here, it's very petite, small sizing. So clothing-wise, it's been hard. But accessories, 10 out of 10. Um, we are going to do a haul. But I think as a separate video, because it's going to be quite a lengthy one yeah. of what we bought in Tokyo. Right now, we're going back to Amor. Because um, I just want to have a quick look at their bags again. We're going to... Oh, maybe we'll go to the Chanel one as well. Because remember last time, the clothes section was closed. We couldn't look at the clothes. Mm -hmm. So I might go back to the Chanel store because I want to have a look at their ready to wear, the Amour Chanel store. Um, because when we went, they only had access to the bags. So yeah, that's what we're doing. And it is such a beautiful sunny day. It's 25 degrees, very warm. I'm not complaining, I love it. But yeah, that's the plan. We're heading to Nobu, which is just literally like a minute away. We're hungry, we're starving, I'm so tired. we're delirious. Yep. Um, True's been editing the Kyoto vlog, which would be live by the time you guys see this. So we had to go home early so he could edit that, so we yep. can get a video live tonight. Well, tonight is Wednesday, because um, we've missed quite a few uploads. Yeah, that's the thing with travel, like it's very difficult to get content out in time. Yeah, because um, obviously True's editing. Yeah. And well, True actually got his friend to help out with editing edit, this yeah. trip. So otherwise, without that, we would not have a video going live until maybe like two weeks later. Yeah. Because <laughs> we have lots of content, and obviously, we're here in Japan for the first time. We want to enjoy it and experience it the most. So we don't want to spend lots of time in the hotel room editing. I think I want to come back here because the first time is very overwhelming because you're discovering new places. Yeah, and the second time. And we have to vlog, and we have to make Instagram content. So yeah, but we'll still do that like, even the second time. Yeah, but it will, we'll be more familiar with it, you know? Yeah. So look, guys, we're already here at Nobu. That was oh, that look. quick. <laughs> There's Nobu. 